What's up, guys? It's me, your pet ass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went to the Dream Yard to go find one of the fr uh, one of the seven sages and all that stuff. Not only that, but we got to meet Looker, the international police guy, and I just realized that I may have skipped over one guy or one of the seven sages. So we're gonna be going back down to Route One, like. You know, Sharon says, uh, <laughs> check every route because you might find something new. And yeah, he was not kidding. Uh, route 1 is, yeah, is home to the very first uh, of the Seven Sages and all that stuff. Just failed to realize that. How do I found that out? Yes, I got the Pokemon Handbook for Pokemon Black and White here. So now, going back to Route 1. And we're going to be locating uh, one of the Seven Sages. Now, in the last episode 2, we also found out that, hey, uh... Yeah, we gotta step up our game. We got Pokemon trainers who are strong. Super strong. Now, another thing that I did too was I actually stocked up on some items because this is going to be an adventure right here and we, we need to complete this whole thing. So now, we're gonna be going right here and going straight back to the area that, you know, we kind of skipped out on before a legendary battle. Actually, the location where we actually got our first, uh, or where we got the Pokemon Egg. So as you can see, guys, we've already been here before. Battled everybody. We had an issue with one of these guys' Pokemon, a Minichu or whatever it was. And, uh, well, everything's completed. Now, the thing that we need to do here is we just need to get to the se one of the seven sages that's right around that area. So we already, you know, we've already gotten all the items and all that crud. Um, if you guys want to know what's here, go back to, well, go back to my playlist and find the, uh, find the episode where I actually got to this location. You're going to find all the items right here, too. So, as you can probably tell, there are some, uh, some currents that might drag you along, might push you along right here. Very, very simple stuff, guys. You just got to know your way around this whole area. So, let's go right here. We already battled her. And, oh wow, that's pushing me back. So, let's go straight right here. We're going to be surfing on our Pokemon, jumping over Homeboy here. Look at that. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you know the surfing right here, you know the surfing, and uh, what, I think I just sent myself back right now, yeah, I sent myself back, so let's see, what if I go, yeah, what if I go down now, I'm just going to put on another repel right here, because I don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon, a lot of these Pokemon trainers guys, I will not be battling, just for the purposes of me finishing this walkthrough right here. Uh, most of these Pokemon trainers here in this location, like I said, I've already battled, defeated, you know, got my stuff, and I still need to know how to get that item right there. So, let's see. Already talked to this guy. And you will be able to find a house right here, a secret house that you'll get the Pokemon egg from. I do not remember what Pokemon it was. And, let's see, we've already pushed all the boulders right here. You'll be able to find one of the seven sages right there on the horizon. So, let's go right ahead and uh, take care of business right now by going down and talk to Homeboy right here. What does he have to say? Let's see. It smells of the sea here. This place has to be the same ocean smell as where I was born. Guess has wandered the lands of this world all over, collecting knowledge of all kinds while, ser while searching for like-minded people. From the moment we met, he understood what I desired. The ability to understand the minds and the needs of others. This is an ability that everyone needs to survive. My Lord N is a kind of a, is kind of a, and an excellent person who understands the hearts of Pokemon. But conversely, perhaps his uh, ability to understand the hearts and feelings of people is not developed uh, enough. But even that was a part of the perfection of Getz's plan. When it comes to Getsis, I cannot separate the truth from the lies. See this? I've received it from Getsis, but I no, no, no longer need it. I hope you can put it to good use. And uh, yeah, we got ourselves a TM32 double team. Another good move right there. And Rude is going to be like, Someday, if my Lord Anne develops the ability to understand the feelings of people and Pokemon, I would like us to gather again. More than anything, I want to see and confront Getsis. Oh wow. Foreshadowing right there, and Looker's gonna be like, ah, 
And now, about Team Plasma. I am an officer of the International Police, and there are so many things you must tell me at once. If that's if that is what you desire. Guess, oh, he's like many things. Now, guess is not, notwithstanding, there yet remains four of the seven sages still at large. What is what it is they are thinking? What is maybe they are hoping? This is the information I, I have I have need of. Quick and soon, say I. Oh damn. Okay, so that was a quick one right there, guys, because we've already been here. We've already done all our homework right here, so yeah, that was a kind of my it wasn't my bad on me right there, you know. I, I didn't realize it. Again, guys, uh, you know, this is the very, very first time I'm showcasing the second portion of Pokemon Black right here on my channel. The first two times when I played this as Draven XE711, I I just, you know, I finished it right there at the battle, the battle, the great battle in the castle, and that was it. Uh, and uh, <laughs> yeah, I didn't I didn't care to re-record anything else. So yeah, I'm taking the extra step right here, guys, for you, so you can actually see what else you could actually find right now. So now I'm not even gonna bother trying to get these items right here because. I don't really know. If you guys already know, then just comment down below. You know, that way I can get them later. Uh, we're still on Egg Watch right here, so we're going to eventually find out what the egg is. And, well, let me check this handbook right here. Okay, so, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Underground Trainer, Seven Sages, Battle the Girl You Traded With. Sure, okay, so let's see. I guess the next one is not so far away. There's quite a few things that I, I want to skip over, guys. Like, there's not a lot of stuff that, you know, that we should be doing. I don't want to showcase on here. I just want the main gameplay. So, let's go ahead and finish it off with one thing right here. Now, if you guys may remember, we traded a girl a while back. Traded for a girl a while back. Uh, a specific Pokemon. I let me see if I actually did trade with her. So we're gonna do we're gonna do the next best thing right here. We're gonna go straight to let's see, hold on, Nat Green City right here, home of the uh, the banana slugs or the orange slugs or something like that. I don't even know. Okay, so if you go to Nat Green City right here, and if you've traded a young lady early on into this adventure, she will be actually wanting to battle you. She's gonna be right here. And let's see. Hold on, just a sec. I, I'm kind of, I kind of think I, that I didn't trade her, but it's worth a shot. Let's see. Uh, do you have a? Okay, so I did not trade. I did not trade for anything right here. And of course, once you, let's see. Do I have a Cottony or a Petalil or whatever? If I do, then you know she might just, you know, she might just get all strong and everything. I don't even know, guys. It has been a while. I started this walkthrough back in like March, I believe. May or March, I don't even know. So, yeah, it's going getting a little laggy right now. So let's go to someone's PC right here. And let's move some Pokemon. And it looks like I don't have the specific Pokemon she is looking for. So, yeah, we're going to stop right here because uh, there's nothing much I can do. Except for, you know, finding a 7th Sage. So... This was the episode. I know it's been short, guys, but trust me, more uh, more will be coming. Like I said before, my goal right here, just do the main gameplay, finish it off with, you know, winning the Elite Four, and then that being that. Um, if you guys have not catched or caught my, uh, my episodes on Pokemon Omega Ruby, the legendary Pokemon that are left right here are going to be in a specific, you know, separate episodes, separate series. That way you guys can, you know, find them easily right here. So... That's just me babbling on. So, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.